That's really creepy. Can you get inside? Of course. What are you doing here? Who are you? Get out! I don't want any trouble whilst I'm gone. Who'll look after us? You advertise for a nanny. Not so fast, Your Highness. Now we can for a boat ride. Unless you abdicate and give your brother the throne, we'll never see your son again. Shh, someone's coming. Excellent, excellent. Tonight, meet me at the beach. It's coming straight for us. Get down, get down. Branch. Oh, really? Yes, really. I did a feature on them last year. I recognized one of the guys. What's Special Branch doing with the King of Baronia? Why don't you go and ask them? I might just do that. Where are they? They should have come past by now. Is there another way to the clifftops? No. I can't see anybody. Maybe they're picking something up instead of dropping something off. I bet they hid something in one of the caves. I can't have a look. Go there at this time of night. You must be joking. You're right. We'll look tomorrow. Agreed? Get in here. Where am I? What is this place? I demand to be taken home. A demand, is it? Used to doing a lot of that, are you? Demanding? Well, it won't do you no good round here. Uncle, please tell me. What's happening? Patience, Paul. You will be released just as soon as your father gives the throne to me. He'll never do that. Never! Oh, well, you'd better hope you're wrong, little nephew. people of Baronia are very happy, Inspector, because we've always led a simple and unspoiled life. But my country has vast mineral wealth, and if my brother became king, he would exploit it and ruin the lives of my people with his greed. <coughs> now, if I don't accept his terms, what will happen to my son? here properly, but there's some major crisis going on, that's for sure. Yes, well, I am sure that Special Branch can handle it without my help. This could be a major scoop, Thaddeus, and I'm right here on top of it. Charlotte, will you please get some sleep? We have a busy day tomorrow. There must be no publicity, Inspector. My brother might panic and harm my son, but please find him. I've got to find out what's going on. Well, will you please do it? Quietly. That room there.
that is. Impossible. This has to be the place. Yeah, they must have dropped something off. Careful, we don't know what's in here. Unless there's a secret passage from the caves to the monastery. A secret passage? You said it was used by smugglers. But smugglers always have secret passages and stuff. We don't know that they are smugglers. We saw them last night. And didn't see anything, Mike. Just a boat. They must have taken it out last night. After we'd gone. Whatever the precious cargo was, we'll never know. Hold on. What is it? There's footprints leading into the cave, but they don't come out again. There must be a secret passage. Jack, up there, near the roof. That has to be it. There must be a way in up there. There's a tunnel through here. It's the secret passage. Come on. to Thaddeus, please. What? I want to speak to Thaddeus. Hang on. Sorry. I want to speak to Thaddeus Arnold. Uh, he's not here, sorry. Please, don't play games with me. What? I know he's there. He's not? He's on a book tour with some Australian woman. I am the Australian woman, and he's not here. He left last night. Well, he's not here either. Well, when he arrives, tell him to call me at the hotel. Thank you. Baronia. Mike, slow down. It goes on for ages. We must be getting near the end. Hey, look! Steps down! Night must be in the house. In the attic. Those men said that that would be the perfect spot. We'd better tell the police. We can't. We don't know what it is yet. You wait here. Jack. We need evidence, Peggy, before we can tell anybody. I'll come with you. No, Mike. Two people make more noise than one. Jack, be careful. Reception. Put me through to the presidential suite, please. Home.
your service. Only the best for our young guest. I'd let him starve, <laughs> do his so good. You have more chips on your shoulder than on that tray, my friend. <laughs> <laughs> Very funny, Mr Diaz. <laughs> yes, I thought it was. Right, Your Highness, get your teeth around that. What's keeping him? Maybe he's been caught. Somebody on the top floor. Who was it? A boy, I think. Sounded like he was crying. But the door was locked. Maybe he's a prisoner. Mike. He could be. Do you mean he's been kidnapped? Yeah, I bet they put him on a boat last night. Honestly, you two are worse than Dad with your vivid imaginations. Maybe Piggy's right. We don't know what's going on, Mike. But maybe this is where we can find out. I want to book the first flight to Baronia. Baronia. Well, if there's no direct flight, get me the first indirect one. Just get me there. Lost your appetite, have you, your highness? No taste for common food. I am not hungry. Oh, I am so sorry. It's not caviar or royal venison. A few more days in here, you'll soon change your tastes. Looking for the royal guard, are we, eh? I can't see no sign of the cavalry out there. Oh, hang on a minute. I don't go nowhere. Oh, let me go! You can't keep me here! Ah! 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 What to your majesty! Like your uncle says, I've got a chip on my shoulder about posh kids like you. You won't get away with this! Hang on, get me in there. What's that noise? Just to see. Sounds loud. Oh, no! Oh. Stupid! I forgot about the tide! Can we swim out? No way, Jack. You'd get sucked under. Dad warned us about getting trapped in caves. He said you could drown before you got outside. So what can we do? Wait? We can't. It'll be hours. It's only just coming in. I might even fill up the whole tunnel. We'd better try and get out through the house. What? But what about those two men? Have you got any better suggestions? Missing? What do you mean Sadius is missing? Don't you speak English, buddy? Charlie Clancy just called to say the guy's vanished. And I'm warning you, if this is some kind of stunt of yours to screw up my book tour... What Thaddeus Arnold does is his own business, sir. The chap's a grown man. Yeah, well, it's about time he started acting like one. If he calls you, let me know. Missing, eh? Charlotte, look, I don't have long. I'm onto something hot in Baronia. I think Thaddeus has been kidnapped. 
Hey, listen. Charlie. No, no, for once in your life, you listen, Dwight. This could be a really big headline. Look. But look, don't go to print on anything yet. I need 24 hours. I'll call you when I have any more news. And what's this? This is our dungeon, the finest in Baronia. You're home until you tell us what you know. For the last time, I am telling you, I know nothing about the kidnapping of your son. My name is Thaddeus Arnold. I am an explorer. And I'm Mickey Mouse. <sighs> this is ridiculous. Find one of my books. There are photographs of me in them. I don't have time to look at books, my friend. My son is in great danger. If you don't tell me where he is, you'll be in great danger too. seem to have got away with it. There's nothing in here at all. So, you know what you have to do? Yep. Well, get on with it then. As soon as we've got the video camera and the computer, I can contact my brother. All right, all right, I'm off. You want me to check on the boy? No, you do what you have to do. I'll check on the boy. Well, I hope you've given me enough money. It's expensive gear, you know, and heavy. Thaddeus kidnapped? Postros. I'm telling you, Charlie Clancy thinks this King of Baronia guy has grabbed her. Well, she would, wouldn't she? She's a journalist. It's her job to make up stories. Hey, listen, buddy. Charlie Clancy has got more integrity in her little finger than I've got in my whole body. Oh, that's not saying very much. Well, if she thinks it's the Baronian guy, I'll back her. Well, before you send in your marine chaps, let me warn you that Britain and Baronia are old allies. Tree. Keep down. That humble man might be about. Look at that nasty dog. <laughs> no, not you, Prince. You should be able to see the attic window from this tree. How do you know it'll be at the window? It's worth a try. I'll have a look. <laughs> no, Prince. You can't climb trees. What can you see? No. Nah. There's no one there. What are you doing with your eyes closed? I'm trying to send a mind message to make him come to the window. You're cracked. He's there. There's someone there. I told you. Hey, over here. Over here. He's seen us. What's he doing? He's signaling with his fingers. What's he saying? I... A... M... I am! P... R... I... S... Prisoner! He stopped. I think someone's come in. You'd break your neck jumping down there. My father will break yours when he catches you. Brave words. You're as stupid and stubborn as your father. Downstairs. What for? I'm planning a little treat for your father. Come along. He said them to us. He really did. You've been reading too many fairy stories. It's true, Ruby. It's not a fairy story. You've got to tell the police. We'll at least go to the house. I make myself a laughing stock. Look what you've made me do. But Ruby. Never mind, but Ruby. You've had your little joke, now off you go. 
me finish this. Give him the paper and hold it up so they can see today's date. Splendid. Hey, that's clever. What are you doing? Sending an email to our friends. I'm sure the king will be very happy to know his son is fit and well for the moment. How about a nice big smile for your father? I suppose you can't blame Ruby. I mean, it does sound a bit incredible. It's got to be prisoner. But what if it's a joke? He could be playing a trick on us, like Ruby thought we were. How could we find out? Send them a my message. We could go and ask him. Funny. I mean it. I'm sure I could get into the monastery. What about the guard dog? Oh. Yeah. I bet I could make friends with that. What? You know animals like me, Piggy. Laura, he'd eat you. Not if I bring something tastier. I wonder what it could be. I know. Do you see how terrified and miserable he looks? Have you no feelings? Is this your son? Don't play games. This was sent by your friends. They've given me 48 hours to give up my throne. You've got 24 hours to tell me where my son is, or else! No, Prince. You stay here. I don't like this. I should come with you. No. Too many people might upset the dog. It'll be all right. Ready? Yep. Yeah. Here, here, here. Come on. You want this, don't you? Well, you're gonna have to come and get it. Here, here, here. Come on. Good dog. Here we go. Good boy. Hello. Them. I'm not waiting any longer. I'm going after them. What about me? You stay here, in case something happens. Just you and me, Prince. <coughs> Hello? Who's there? My name's Jack. We signaled to you today. Please, you've got to help me. I'm a prisoner. I can't. The door's locked. Then go and tell the police. I'm Prince Paul of Baronia. Who? Huh? Prince Paul of Baronia. I've been kidnapped. Please, believe me. I can't believe you. Don't stand there chattering. Go and get help. Quickly. You certainly sound like a prince, ordering people about. Please. OK, I'm going. Keep your crown on. I'm not wearing a crown. I mean, oh, forget it. I'll be back soon. The dog. That would be